understand you're quite taken with this part of the country, Mr. Cantrell. Leonard, yes, ma'am. I like what I see out here, and I like what I breathe out here. And I've, I've just about made up my mind that I'm going to make this my home. Oh. Well, from what I've seen, I'd say you're a very determined young man. <laughs> I take that as a compliment, Mrs. Corcoran. I don't mind saying it. This is one of the finest meals that I've ever had. Oh, thank you, Leonard. It's simple, you know. Mr. Mr. Corcoran doesn't really care for fancy food. Though I imagine you've tried just about every kind of exotic dish in New York. Exactly. You? See, that's, that's the trouble. It's exotic, but it's not honest. I mean, it's fancy, but it's not, it's not real. I mean, this is honest food. There, there's no lying in, in that beef. There, there's no uh, insincerity in those potatoes. There's no deceit in the cauliflower. This is a, a totally honest meal. You don't know what a pleasure it is to sit down in this day and age and, and eat food that you can believe in. Oh, oh what an original way of putting it. <laughs> Leonard's so positive, isn't he, Mother? Who does he remind you of when he's so positive like that? Who, oh dear? You know. Oh, yes. Oh, my goodness, why didn't I notice that? Oh, of course. <laughs> Tell me, Leonard, have you given any thought to what your future plans might be? I've given it a lot of thought, Mrs. Corcoran, the careful thought. Uh, I thought, actually, I would like to do something that concerns the land. The land? Oh, you mean, you mean farming? Farming? No, I don't really think so. And yet, it's hard to say. You see... I want to get back to origins, to, to basics, you know, back to the soil, so to speak. So many young people today are, are going in that direction, concerned young people. I think we've taken enough out of this country. I, I believe it's time that we started to think about putting something back into this country. Oh, you know that's very well put, Leonard. You know, I read an editorial in the Minneapolis Star this morning that said the very same thing. Really? I didn't see that. 